In this video, we'll show you how to measure the depth of an object, such as a dent, using the depth mode in the IPLEX NX video scope. Using the depth mode, you can measure the distance from a measurement point to a reference plane, defined by three reference points. This mode is useful for measuring the depth of a dent on turbine blades. Make sure that a stereo measurement tip adapter is attached onto your scope and the serial numbers displayed on the screen match the serial numbers on the scope and the tip adapter. The optimal tip to target distance is one of the key factors that improves measurement accuracy. All Olympus video scopes with stereo measurement have the unique spot ranging feature that gives you the tip to target distance in real time. The IPLEX NX video scope has multi spot ranging capabilities so you can see five simultaneous tip to target distances in real time. This means you instantly know if you are at the optimal position for measurement before you begin. The multi-spot ranging indicator shows the respective distances at each of the five positions between the distal end and the target. You can move this circle or change its size to instantly know the desired tip to target distances. Press the measure button on the touch screen or the remote control to start the measurement process. Select depth from the menu. Set a reference plane to measure depth on a surface. To achieve better measurement accuracy, it is important to set the right reference plane. 3D modeling makes it easier to specify the exact location of your measurement points. With the 3D modeling capability on the IPLEX NX video scope, it is now even easier to visualize and specify the exact location of the points. To generate the 3D model, go to Menu, select the 3D option, and then press the 2D 3D button. You can rotate and zoom in the 3D model on the right-hand window to clearly visualize the blade section. Place the cursor on three points to define the reference plane, then touch the Enter button. Place the cursor on the point where you want to measure the distance to the reference plane. You can specify a more accurate cursor position by using the zoom function. This is another capability on the IPLEX NX video scope that helps you achieve better measurement results. To do this, simply press the zoom button on the touch screen or the remote control, and the image around the cursor position will be magnified. Now you can more accurately choose the measurement point. You can select a maximum of three points for each measurement task. If you need to modify any points after completing the measurement task, select Modify from the menu. This gives you the option to modify either the left or right image. It is generally recommended only to modify the left image. After selection, you can modify any of the reference or measurement points. Make sure to confirm that the modification made in the left image is correctly reflected in the right image. After you confirm your reference plane and measurement point, press the Enter button. The distance between the point and the reference plane will be displayed. A positive value means the point is closer to the tip of the scope than the reference plane, and a negative value means the point is farther away. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please refer to the instruction manual of your video scope for further details. If you have questions, please visit the Olympus website or contact your local Olympus representative.